Hi everyone, I'm Nina Kaskar, or Miss Scarlet in the Study, and today I am doing something I swore I would never, ever, in a million years, ever do. Today I am replaying Mist. For any of you who are lucky enough to not have heard me rant about Myst, um, here's a quick recap of my current feelings about this game. I had spent a full week of my life a few summers ago fumbling through Myst. It has haunted me since the day I started playing it and has remained the only game I refuse to ever put myself through again. Until now. I feel like enough time has passed where I've forgotten most of the puzzles, and to be honest, I don't think I ever really understood the full story of the game, so it's like I can go in with fresh eyes and a new perspective. I've got some tea to keep myself calm and relaxed as I go through the process of diving into the only game I truly despise. Um, so without further ado, let's travel to Mist. Alright. <laughs> So I'm going to be playing Real Mist today, which is actually the version that I had played the first time, so I want to keep as close to my original as I can and try to get a different look at it. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. I don't know why my heart is beating so fast. Okay. I realized the moment I fell into the fissure that the book would not be destroyed as I had planned. Continue my hands are into that starry <laughs> expanse of which I had only a fleeting glimpse. I've tried to speculate where it might have landed, but I must admit that such conjecture is futile. Still, the questions about whose hands might one day hold my misbook are unsettling to me. I know my apprehensions might never be allayed, and so I close, realizing that perhaps the ending has not yet been written. All right, I'm already feeling a little... Um, I don't even know how to explain how I'm feeling right now. I just feel very overwhelmed because I can feel the trauma from the last time I played this, and I just got instant palm sweat. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go into this. I don't remember too much about it, so hopefully I don't struggle too much, and that I can just look at this as a regular puzzle game like everything else I play. Let's just take a deep breath in, everyone, and we're going to start at uh, Mist. Okay. Oh my gosh, that noise. The noise alone, the little sound effect when you're like traveling to places. Oh, let me just like stretch out my neck. Just make sure we're breathing and we're, we're okay. So I think I'm gonna go with Classic Mist. I believe that's what I did the first time I played this and I wanna keep everything as close to my original playthrough as I can, or as well as I remember it. I don't even remember most of this game. So let's just dive into it. Um, Okay, so we can get to the main menu with escape. All right. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I shouldn't be nervous. I'm like full body sweating now. Okay. Um, so this is the island that we start on. <sighs> okay. <laughs> and it wouldn't be missed without levers. So I don't even remember what the levers do, but I'm going to flip them because I feel like that's the right thing to do. I don't know what that lever just did. Hopefully it didn't ruin something and, oh, okay. I'm gonna go up here, this looks like, I'm gonna try to explore everything first. Take it in, kind of get into the groove. Ugh. I just, I cannot explain like the pain, like the, the physical pain of going back to this. Okay, fresh eyes, new perspective, let's keep going. Okay, so this island's really pretty. I like it. I know that it can get dark, it can get like nighttime later in the game, I think. And I don't really love the um, the nighttime look. I think it would stress me out. Okay, there's another lever. Can I go in here? Ooh! A little dentist's office? I don't know. Is this a dentist chair? A torture chair? We'll never know. Um, but I'm sure we will find out. Okay, let's go in. I think this is the library. Actually, I do remember this part. I think this is the library. 
Um, and we've got some stuff to look at. We got a map. Look at this map. Oh. Okay, that does something. All right. Like I said, I don't remember too much about this. I don't know what that puzzle is, but I'm assuming that's a puzzle of some sort. Um, I do remember these. Okay, so they're, these are books, and I think I have to put this page in the book. And yeah. Okay. What are you trying to tell me? I can't, I can't see. You read, you read, you must. What? I think this is also just another thing I didn't like about this game. You know what? I need to not focus on the things I didn't like. I need to accept it for what it is. I, I have no idea what he's trying to tell me. I am serious. Okay, so what I've learned from this is that I have no idea what he just said or what he wants me to do, but there's a guy living in this book. Good for him. Like, I would love to just live in a book. Save on rent, you know? I'm here for it. Okay, um, what else we got in here? We got a little picture. He does something? He just does a swirly. Oh, it opened this up. What's in here? Let's look at and explore. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Um. Obviously, you get in the elevator. This is this game is so easy. Look, I think fig I figured out this puzzle. You just get in the elevator. Puzzle solved. Uh, library. Oh, it's telling me we were at the library, and it's gonna take me up somewhere. Okay. Let's figure this out. Now we're in the tower. We're in Rapunzel's tower. Okay, let's climb up the steppy steps. Alright, it looks like this is closed or something. Maybe? I don't know. Uh, I think I think the good thing is that I don't remember much about this game, so this is good, because now I'm looking at it again, fresh eyes, but I think it also is hindering me because I don't know what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna basically put myself through what I went through a few years ago already. Um, so this has got a key. I think that's all that's in here. So if I remember correctly, I have to like twist this tower, I think. Um, I'm not quite sure how I do that, but I will figure it out. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, so we're back at the library. It doesn't say library, so I hope we're at the library and I didn't just go somewhere else. Um, I really don't love the navigation in this game, and I think that was the option that they gave me at the beginning of the game to maybe use arrow keys, um, but this is definitely something I didn't fully enjoy is the, the short travel when you click. Oh, I can't get out of here now. Maybe I gotta re-push that painting and it will... Nope, nope, turn around. How do I turn around? No, 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 sir. Sir. Um, turn. There you go. Maybe I gotta push this again. Oop, it's telling me no. So maybe I click something else. Oh, maybe I click this one and then this one will close it. Gotta use your brain, guys. Alright! Yeah, so that closed and this opened. Okay, so now we can look at the blue book and hopefully I can understand the blue guy better. Let's see. Monsieur. I'm so sorry. I don't. I don't know what you're saying. Help me. Help me. I heard help me. Blue pages. Blue pages. Well. 
than ever. Something, something. Disappear. I must have the blue page. Blue pages. Okay, so I at least understood he wants blue pages. I could I could understand some of what he said. You know what? I'm on his side. He's already way more articulate, so let's just go and get him blue pages. Because clearly he was very direct and told me what he wanted. Um, what's this? Uh-oh. Did I just lock myself in here? Well, clearly this is a puzzle I don't know how to do yet. Um, so let's maybe get on out, out of here. I don't know what that means. Um, hopefully we'll find a clue somewhere. Or maybe it'll be like I remember and there's no real clues and I just gotta do things until things happen. Okay, I'm lucky that it's a nice sunny day here. What's this? Not sure I like the sound of that, but it looks like I can push these little buttons. So that's cool. Is it? I don't know if it's cool, but and there is a little shippy ship. Okay, oh, there's a lever. Lever. Let's Oh, there you go. So there's another lever. I think I'm just going to pull all the levers up. I don't know if they're all supposed to just be in the up position and that does something or if each lever controls something different. What's in here? I don't know if I- this is also another thing, I don't know if I'm doing this in the right order, or if I'm supposed to be in these places, but we'll figure it out. Okay. Can I just, like, turn these on? I don't know, maybe there's, like, a number I'm supposed to make them? Oh. Well, no, that one's not working. I'm... it's... It's okay. Um, I think I actually broke this, uh, cause it looks like they're not working. Hold on, maybe I'll make that one go down to zero first. Awesome, I think I broke it. One, okay, so the switches are one through ten, and it doesn't tell me what number it needs to be at to, like, reset it, maybe? I don't know, but... That's what that is. It powers a ship. Good to know. I don't see a ship, but um, we'll eventually find it. Ooh, a lever. I don't know. I always had an issue with these levers, but I think it's quite therapeutic to like put them in the up position. I, I feel like it did something. I feel productive. Um, oh, did the lights just go out? Wee, wee. Okay, I don't know what that does. Um, okay, fine. Ooh, there's a safe. I don't know the numbers for it yet, but uh, there's a safe in here. So if we ever find numbers, maybe they go into that lock. Um, let me see what else we got. Ooh, we got more uh, knobbies. Uh, let's do that. Ooh. Oh, this one changes the time. Boom. Okay. Clearly, I don't have the answer to that puzzle yet. But there is a lever over here that I obviously can't reach. I was, like, trying to flip it, but I'm like, my arms aren't extendo arms to get over there. So I think I have to figure out maybe to make a bridge, something. But there's a lever over there that I have not flipped. So I need to keep that in my, my brain. Or what's left of it, anyways. Um, was there anything else? There wasn't anything else over there. Is this it? I remember this being so much larger. Maybe I was just freaking out for no reason. This does, this looks manageable. Oh, there's a ship. It's a rocket ship. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the sky. Okay, I'm going to flip this switch and I'm going to go into the ship. The ship is locked. Okay. It's, it's 
ship is locked. What do we, how do we unlock the ship? Um, I think I want to do, yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to make my sole mission to get into that ship now. Because I want to zoom off of this game. Um, alright. <laughs> Let's keep a move on. I think I've looked at everything. Oop, I think I just saw something. <laughs> I thought this was a rock! I thought that was a rock. That's a very good hiding place for a uh, clue, but thought it was a rock. It's definitely a piece of paper. Okay, so let's read. Catherine, I've left you. <laughs> I don't know what type of voice am I doing. Okay, Atris, that's his name. So what does Atris sound like? Okay. Um, I bet he's one of those guys in the books and I don't know which one, so I'm just going to make up a voice. So here we go. Catherine, I've left for you a message of utmost importance in our four chamber beside the talk. We, they have a four chamber. Um, that's, that's fancy living. Uh, enter the number of marker switches on this island into the imager to re retrieve the mess. I'm illiterate. Um, so basically we gotta enter the number of marker switches on this island into the imager to retrieve a message. Um, Atris. Okay. I bet that's not even how you pronounce that, but here we go. Oh, we're just gonna put it back on the ground. Interesting. Uh, so let me go count the number of switches. I think I'm gonna start on that end and then um, count. I can count. That's that's easy enough. It seems a little too easy. Hope I don't mess this up. This seems a little too easy. One, two, three. Count with me. <laughs> Four. Um, that's five back there. Six. Six. And then there's one down here, I know. Seven. Oh, and there was one up there. So eight. Eight? That seems like too little. Also, like, wouldn't it be like ten? Like, I feel like ten is such a code number you entered the number 10 but I, I counted eight so let's try eight and i think this is the four chamber i didn't look at this earlier um but this is the four chamber i do remember this place oh it's dark um okay <laughs> we'll just roll with it okay let's see this is not scary at all oh and the music is not creepy and i'm not just completely sweaty Hmm. Okay, what we got here? That didn't do anything. Is there a place for me to put a number? Eight is the magic number right now. Okay, that button didn't do anything. Ooh, there's a piece of paper. Maybe it's instructions. Um, topographical extrusion test. Marker switch diagram and water turbulent pool. I don't know what that means, but oh, maybe I click that. Oh, hey, we can put a number in. So I need to put an eight. Button. Oh. Okay, maybe something happened, and I gotta push this button now. Oh no, what happened? It's hard for me to believe, and most of my books have been destroyed. Catherine is one of our sons. I suspect Agatha, oh. but I shouldn't lead to conclusions. I'll find him and Cirrus as well. Oh, I should have known better than have left my library unchecked for so long. Well, I've removed the remaining undamaged books from the library and placed them in their places of protection. You shouldn't have to use the books until I return, but... If you've forgotten the access keys, remember the tower rotation. Oh, and don't worry, Catherine. Everything will be fine. I'll see you shortly. Oh, and erase this message after you viewed it, just to be safe. Okay. Um. So, okay, I think that's my husband. If I'm Catherine, or am I just somebody who came to the island and found Catherine's message and Catherine's not really here, or am I actually Catherine? I don't know. I'm trying to piece the story together because I never really fully understood this. So it looks like their two sons are doing something bad, and 
I have to do, I think I, I heard towel rotation, but I think it must be tower rotation. Um, I wish this came with subtitles because I can't really figure out what they're saying, but at least I could understand most of what he meant. Uh, their two sons, so Atris and I guess I'm Catherine, and their two sons are doing something bad, and I need to do tower rotations to s solve things? Maybe? Okay, so uh, he said to erase his message. Is this how I erase it? Is this the erase button? <laughs> erase. I don't know. He says to destroy the message afterwards. I don't know if that did anything or not, but I'm just gonna roll with that. So he said something about tower rotation. So I know we were in the tower earlier, so if I can find like a mechanism to rotate it, maybe that's what I have to do. Okay. So far this isn't too bad. I'm actually not completely upset with this game yet. I'm sure we will get to a point where I am, but... <laughs> Mm. Okay. Um, so the tower's in here. So let's go on in here. Um, oh, oh, you know what? I didn't even really look at this map. It says tower rotation. Yay! Okay. I like it. I like when I figure things out. Okay, so it says tower rotation, so maybe I gotta do something with it. Um... Oh, ho, ho, that rotates the tower. Okay, so that's what's rotating it. I just don't know where I want this line, though. We'll see it's red now. Maybe it needs to not be red. Or maybe it needs to be red. I don't know why it keeps getting stuck. Okay, I don't know what the red line means. Oh, maybe those are the places I need to go. Okay, well clearly I want to do the spaceship. So maybe if I leave that there, it's telling me that that's where... I, I, uh, uh, maybe? <laughs> okay, so it's on the rocket, so maybe the that did something to the rocket? Or did it move the tower so that I could go into the rocket from the tower? You know what, let's try that first. Let's not get carried away. I'm gonna try, because I rotated the tower, therefore I would need to go into the tower, yes? Um, I don't know why that, that doesn't, I don't know. I don't know. So this is the tower, right? I went up the elevator and it took me to tower. Mm. Let's see. What can we do here? I'm like so nervous because I feel like I got what we're doing, but it seems a little too simple now. Because I think it would just let me get onto the ship. Okay, let's see. Let's go on up. Oh, I don't think I did it right. This is still closed. Well, I see the ship. Is there maybe something else I'm supposed to do to maybe open this? Is it supposed to open? Who knows? I mean, I know everyone else probably knows and I'm just sitting here clueless. Um, so I don't know, that's not open. I thought it would like open up and I could go to the ship, but let's see if there's a Thing on this side, there's a key that the oh wait, there's something up there now. There wasn't something up here earlier. Ooh, 59. Okay, I'm gonna write this down because I feel like that's just something I need to know. 59 volts. Volts. Um, okay, so that's an obvious clue to possibly get onto the ship. Maybe that'll open the, the tower. I don't know what 59 volts means. <laughs> It's a good clue. I'm not bashing the clue. It's probably a really good clue. Um, at least it is a clue. At least I'm getting some sort of direction. So I need to go somewhere that I could possibly put in voltage. I know there's like power lines outside, so maybe I have to do something with those. Um, I'm not sure. Okay. Um, all right. I at least have direction now. I'm glad we got some direction. I think my main complaint about this game was that I just never knew what I was doing. So at least now I kind of know what I'm trying to possibly do. I'm not entirely sure. I'm just trying to be confident. At least let's just say we know what we're doing and hopefully it'll work out. 
was like, why are these green? I think I turned them on earlier. I was like, ooh, is that a clue? It's not a clue. Um, okay, so I can go... Ooh, you know what had volts? I think this was voltage. Unless it was, like, pressure. Maybe it's not volts. I don't know. This place had, um, numbers. Let's go. Okay. So now I need to get this to 59. Um, I'm pretty sure. Unless that's not what that is. It doesn't say volts. Maybe this isn't the place. This is the only place I could see that you could put in, like, a number. I mean, I know you can put numbers in other places, but this looks like it could be voltage. I don't know how to get 59, though. Oh, I'm gonna have to write down... Okay, so let's just try to keep track of these. Alright, alright. Um, this is gonna be... Uh, 10... 10, 1... Oh gosh, I feel like, is there an easier way for me to do this? I'm asking to the camera and no one's gonna answer me. Uh, 7, 2. So I have to make 59, I'm thinking this is what I have to do. Because this seems like the most logical place that I could put in a voltage number. 22. Uh, this is gonna be 16. And 19. Five and nine. So now if I can try to figure out a way to make 59 out of these numbers. Just carry the one. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, maybe not that one. I'll put that in last. Okay. 19 plus 16 equals 35, and if I add 20, 57, oh, 59, 59, yeah, Okay, um, so clearly this is not the place I'm supposed to do this, or I just messed something up, or both of these are supposed to be 59 and I can't get that one to do anything. Is there like a reset button maybe? It doesn't say there's a reset button. It says power to ship, so I assume that's the rocket ship, yeah? Maybe I'm just in the wrong place altogether. <laughs> I'm panicking, it just, it's just very stressful. <laughs> Um, <laughs> oh no, okay, is there a place I can put voltage in over here? I don't know. It says power to ship, that's why I assumed it would be that place, but maybe it's not, or maybe I broke it, and I have to find a reset button. That's also like, oh, that says PSI. I mean, is that, that's not voltage. What's PSI? PSI Miami. Oh, somebody stopped me. Um, okay, so that's the only place. Guys, it's getting dark! Oh, I don't like this game when it gets dark because it's scary. Okay, um, PSI has nothing to do with voltage. I'm thinking, um, maybe this has something to do with voltage. Hold on. Maybe I'm supposed to enter a number up here. Maybe I'm just stupid and this is what I'm supposed to Oh, maybe this is what I'm supposed to do. Okay. Um, it's a lever. Well, that didn't do anything. Or maybe it did and I have to go find what it did. It like atta attaches into here. I don't know. I don't know if that's like maybe the power switch. Maybe that was like a reset. No, I doubt that was a reset button. It would say like reset button, right? I feel like I've just been asking questions, <laughs> which is the true essence of Mist is just, just ask questions until you hear the answer in the distance. Um, okay. Did this do anything? Oh, that one says 59 now! Did that fix it or did that just, it still doesn't look like it did something? 
Like there's no click, no pop, no sizzle. But I think that switch probably reset this area. It reset that thing. Well, I hope that has something to do with voltage because it says power to ship. That's why I'm thinking that's right, but it doesn't say volts on it unless it did and I'm just blind, which is not uncommon for me. All right, let's go see if it did anything to the ship. Or I guess it would do something to the tower? What's the power to ship? Oh my gosh, I'm just so confused right now. Let's just go to the ship. If, it, if this didn't do anything, then uh, we'll just go to the tower and then maybe I go to the ship from the tower and then... <gasps> it opened. Okay, it opened. Is that what it did? Is that, it just unlocked the door for me? Okay. Hello. <laughs> okay. Hmm. hmm. Um, so it's a piano. And it looks like this thing can also do notes. All right, I'm supposed to find a combination of notes. Now, where would I find that? Combination of notes, combination of notes. If I were notes, where would I be? Not playing Mist, that's where I'd be. Okay, um, I'm thinking there's gotta be books on the subject. Maybe there's like a piano book. Hold on, let's go look for a piano book. What does that say? Channelwood? Channelwood, I think that's part of the game, right? I don't know. It says Stone Ship on that one. I don't know what this one says. Oh gosh. Am I supposed to read all of this? Because I don't want to. Um, oh gosh. Okay, so this got like a little compass thing. Oh, there's the ship. That's the ship. Um, it does it. Oh, I don't know what any of this means. I doubt. Same. Same fam. I doubt. Uh, oh, oh, there's a piano. Hold on. There's a piano. Okay. All right, so we got C. Middle C. <laughs> Do I look pretty? Um, let's see what else we got. Um, three is going to be that one okay and then four or five okay gotcha gotcha so we got a an e flat a <laughs> an f and a b flat okay so i hope i hope okay i hope that's right i don't know i wrote it down so let's go play the piano that should be easy enough we just gotta Type in those uh, code, uh, the notes. Easy enough. This is gonna be easy. I like piano puzzles. I feel like they're genuine, genuinely, generally, generally fun. Um, I do enjoy like a good music puzzle. I don't remember this at all, so this is fun. Okay, um, let's go to the piano, and we, I think we just gotta type the the things in. So we got C, middle C. E flat, F, and B flat. That did nothing. Um, oh, I th This can't be the puzzle. This can't be it. Do I have to put the notes on this? Okay, only somebody with perfect pitch could do this. Like, what in- No, that can't be the real puzzle. Who in there- who would be able to do this besides somebody who's musically inclined? I mean... Does that sound like a C to you? I don't know. That's why the piano's there so you can listen to the note and then match pitch. They did not do this.
I love piano puzzles. Let's do this. Okay, um, C. <laughs> All right, now I gotta match that pitch. That sounds right. Do I have to do this for every note? Oh my gosh. That sounds right. Does that sound right? I don't know, that sounds right to me. I don't know if that's completely wrong and I'm just really bad at matching pitch, but I think that could possibly be right. And then we need a middle C. <gasps> you know what I could do? Oh my gosh, I think, I think it would only need to find one note. Cause if I find C, I can just go. All right, so let's put this at C. And then I'd have to go eight up from there would be an octave to middle C. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That sounds like an octave to me. I think that sounds right. No, that doesn't sound right at all. Oh, it's going up half steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve. So twelve up from that. I don't know why that sounds like an octave to me. <laughs> That's not an octave. One, oh, what? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's an octave. I was like, what in the world? Okay. Which will sound like middle C now. I think. Does that sound like that? I don't even know. Okay, so now we need um, an E flat, which will be... Oh gosh, how many steps up is that? Uh, 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 that's three steps up from that last one, so okay. <laughs> one, two, three. This is tedious. If you can't hear it, I also hope that I didn't mess up the first note because I feel like... Okay, I feel like that sounds the same, but I'm not even sure. Um, okay, and then we have F is next. This, this cannot be the puzzle. This cannot... I have to be doing something wrong. And we need an F now, which is one, two, three, four, five steps from... From the first one. Okay, so if I'm here, is that lined up? <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Gotta keep it in your head. Uh, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Um, and then we need a B flat. Oh, B flat. Easy enough. Two steps down from that C. Okay. Whew. Uh-oh, okay. So if I'm here and I go... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> that sounds right, I think. Will it tell me if I'm right? Or will it just be like, no, do it again? I'll just cross our fingers, maybe that worked. It did something. Okay, there's a book. Is this a clue? Or am I supposed to click- am I supposed to click on it? Maybe I'm supposed to click on it. I'm like, is this a clue? What book am I going after now? Okay. This is exciting. I solved my first puzzle. Okay, I think I just have to click on it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> okay. Um, Alright, looks like... Oh, I can get off- the ship. Are we somewhere else now? Yeah, we're somewhere else. Okay. So I think I vaguely remember this, that this game is separated into ages. Um, I don't know which age this is, but uh, we're here. Welcome to my crib. Uh, <laughs> okay, so I would like to get through this age. I don't know what 
we have to do here, but let's try to get some sort of idea and we'll roll with it. Okay, let's get let's get this let's go. This is now we're into the game now. We're into our first age. Okay, um, what's this? It looks like it's locked, and we've got. All right, we have noises. Okay, so this is like that thing on the ship. I think we have to put them in the correct order, so maybe I have to find a clue as to what order I need to put that in. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, let's just start from the left and go go around, because I think I will get lost on this little island here. Um, this is kind of pretty. It's very fall, uh, fall-like. I like that. Ooh, this is water. Am I supposed to push this? Ooh, maybe I'm supposed to put them in a specific order? Oh, it's a page! Blue page! ba na 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 Okay, so I just pushed that button. I don't know what that did, but um, it looks like there's a little microphone here that's capturing the water sound. So maybe that's what I have to do for the door. Is it the order in which I see them, or is there going to be a piece of paper that tells me the symbol, maybe? Okay, I'm getting way too ahead of myself. Let's just explore. Um, okay, what is this one? It looks like there's a little path. Oh, can I not go that way? Hello? Oh, I just have to... Oh, find my way. <laughs> the navigation in this game is is definitely one of the things I really don't like about it. But like I said, there is an option that you can use the arrow keys, so maybe that's easier. Um, this looks like volcano stuff. Sounds like a little volcano. I, what do you call that? <laughs> Magma? Lava? Um, so it looks like heat. Something, something warm. I don't know, it's doing like a little fire sound, so. Oh, water, fire. Maybe I'm looking for like earth and air next. I don't know. I got water and fire. I don't know if I have to write these things down. You know what, maybe a good idea. Water and fire is what I got so far. Um, and I'll draw the little symbol. This had like a crack with steam and then this one had little droplets. Okay, maybe that's important, maybe it's not. We will never know. Um. <laughs> We will find out eventually. I say we will never know, but we will know eventually and we will be enlightened. Um, this sounds like a clock. So maybe this is time. It's got a little clock thingy. Okay. All right, good enough, good enough. Um, so I got three, three little sounds. Oh, I should have written down how many sounds I needed for that door. Oh well, we'll find it again. Um, what's this? It looks like a little... Oh, there's the stairs. I was like, where do I go? Okay, so this is kind of scary, honestly. There's these crystal shards. That's a pretty sound, though. I honestly don't know if I'm supposed to be pushing these buttons, but I am. Um, this is a red page, but I think I can only hold one page at a time. I don't think I can hold both. Can I? No, I don't think I can. I don't want to pick it up because I don't want to go back and go get the blue page. I think I'm going to find, I'm going to collect blue pages. Again, I'm not totally clear on the story of Mist, but I think I like the blue, ca the blue page guy better because he enunciated. So I know he wants blue pages. The red guy could probably just want pizza and he couldn't tell me because he doesn't articulate. Um, so I, why would I get him pages? He didn't ask me for them. Uh... <laughs> Okay, so I'm just gonna collect the blue pages. I don't know what they do. I don't know what they mean. I don't know if one's a good guy, one's a bad guy. Uh, I'm blindly collecting pages at this point. Um, what's over here? Um, oh wait, I forgot to write down the shards. Those crystal shard things looked like this. Okay. And then I think, what is this? Ooh. I don't know what this is. I don't know what that means. Maybe that's air. I'll just write it down air because it looks like little air particles. Steamy things. It, the, the air is getting steamy. Um, there's a ladder. Can I not use the ladder? Ooh, I can. Okay. Ooh. Oh, do I flip the? Oh no. Okay, I'm genuinely scared now. Okay, I don't. Oh, okay, there's bats. It's fine. We're just gonna, we're gonna go. Is Nothing's gonna happen, right? 
Okay, uh, do I flip this? I don't know what that did, but let's get on out of here. Okay, so this took me over here to this. Oh gosh! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my heart! <laughs> um. Okay, that legit scared me. Okay. <laughs> Um, so what can I do here? So am I going to write down these numbers? 0191? Well, that just looks like that one's broken. Maybe I have to do something with that? Um, well, these all sound broken to me. What do these do? Oh! These move. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to line them up with their correspondent. Like, I'm supposed to go to the water tower. Like, see, that's the the crystal shard place. And then I need to find water. Okay, I think I know what I'm doing. I think I'm trying to find water with this. Where's the water tower? That's clock tower. I hope this is right. I mean, it makes sense. I would want to line them up. Maybe it's like a coordinates thing. And then maybe the numbers are gonna be entered for something else later. That sounds like fire. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to make this, like, just listen to it. Maybe not look exactly where I'm going. I don't... Mm -hmm. That's wind. I see you, wind. Okay, it's gone blank. Maybe I went too far. Oh, no. Did I go too far? Because I'm back at crystals. Oh, no. That's clock? Where's water? Okay, hold on, let me try something else. Let's do fire, since I know I found fire before. Um, fire. Fire, fire, fire. It was here somewhere. That was crystals. Clock. Oh, there's fire. Oh, that's water! Oh, okay, hold on. I found the water one. That's good. Okay. still hear the water. Is that bad? I don't know if I need to be like point accurate. Maybe I need to... Well, I'm not getting sound anymore. All right, I'll just leave it at that and then I'm just gonna take this over to the water section. I think now that I found it. Um, but the thing that's bothering me is you can hear the water in the fire section. There we go. Perfect! There's fire, but I can hear water in the background, so that might not be right. This one's the time one, so I need to look at the clock tower. Oh my goodness, I really hope this is right, otherwise I'm wasting a ton of time. <laughs> I think the clock's back this way, actually. That's good that you can go both directions, I like that. Me trying to say something positive about this game. <laughs> Sounds like staticky. Okay, that sounds right to me. I can still hear water in the background. I don't know if I'm supposed to hear the water or if that's a mistake. It means that I'm like a couple points off. I don't know. Let's see. Now if I go... Oh, okay, there's the sh this one's easy to find because the shards are so giant. I love that. Okay, we good? We Gucci? Yeah! Alright, and then this one is the... the air one, I think. Okay. I really hope this is right. <laughs> I'm actually very excited to see if this is right. I can still hear the water, is that bad? Alright, that sounds right. I got some static in this, maybe I gotta like... Okay, and is this like the enter button? Maybe I need to write these down, hold on. Okay, hold on. Oh, maybe this is telling me the order. The crystals. 
water, air, fire, clock. Do I need to write their numbers down too? Let me write their numbers down too, just in case. So the, the crystal is gonna be 0136. The water is 1310. I really hope these are important, otherwise I'm writing them down for no reason. Uh, 202, I guess better safe than sorry with this type of thing. Rather write it down than backtrack. 115.0, and then we need uh, the clock, which is 055. I don't know if those numbers are important or not, but I think maybe that's telling me the order that I need to put the sounds on that door. So, um, cool. That's... That could be the answer, it could possibly not be the answer. I've been 100% wrong on tons of things in my life, so. Um, oh, I really hate this little tunnel thing. Ah! Okay, just go, just go, just go, just go. Don't look back, don't look back, don't look back. Go, go, go. I think this turns off the light. Conserve energy, let's just turn off the light. Um, all right, and then now that we're back here, let me, where was that door? The door was where I came off the ship, so I just need to find the ship and then I'll find the door. Easy enough. Um, I think. I don't know. Who knows? I don't... I wish there was some more, um, like, background music. I think it's a lot of just wind noises. Which I think is kind of relaxing if you're into that, like, uh, nighttime sounds, soothing sounds type thing. It's kind of cool, but I kind of, I want some more music. All right, so like, let's see this thing. So it said crystal water air. So let me look for that crystal sound. Well, that's not, oh, maybe I'm looking for different sounds. I haven't heard any of these sounds. Maybe I'm doing this wrong. Maybe they're not looking for that sound. I haven't heard any of these sounds though. That's a crystal thing though. Okay, crystal. That's definitely air, so maybe I'm right. Crystal. That's fire. That's the clock, okay. There's water. That's air for sure. So we need fire, which I think was down here. Fire. And then the clock was also down here somewhere. Okay. And then I push the button. Oh, so they probably just threw in extra sounds to throw you off. Like, I didn't hear that train at all. Mm -hmm. mm, 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 mm. Okay. Now we go into the tunnel. Yay. All right. So where are we going now, guys? <laughs> I really don't like this place because it gives me the heebie-jeebies. Okay, we got a button at the end of the hallway here. Okay, so the button's gonna do something cool and we'll do more cool things because mist is cool. Um, <laughs> all right, can I go this way? Oh, that's just turning me around. I don't want that. So do I get into this little submarine thing? That's probably what I do. Let's get in the submarine. Uh, oh, so that closed the door. Nice little privacy, I like that. And, uh, let's just, uh, go forward, I guess. Onward and upward. There's nowhere to go but forward, I guess. I don't feel like we're going forward, I feel like we're spinning. I can't even tell if we're going up or if we're going down. This is very disorienting. Okay, we're going south now, and southeast. East, east, northeast, west, east, west. Um, okay, so I guess we're gonna go forward on this track. Forward. Oh, excuse me, forward. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, I probably have to navigate uh, like a maze, maybe? Let's go forward. Oh, maybe that red dot means I can't go there. Yeah, so it looks like that, that means I can't go. Where am I supposed to go then? They're all locked! Was I supposed to do something else? That's where I came from. I don't want to go backwards. That's a no. Ooh, maybe I can go this way? Let's 
just everyone hold on tight. Let's go. <laughs> I hope that's right. Okay. Now, okay, so I'm thinking I need to find the thing that's open. I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> I feel like maybe that should be the strategy. Just keep going to the right until we eventually find okay so that's where we came from we don't want to go there um is that where we came from oh no i just got Damn, maybe that's not where we came from that's where we came from well i guess we'll find out soon enough if i have to turn around or not whoop-de-doo i wonder how long this is gonna be i wonder how long the track that i'm looking for is Okay. That looks like I can go that way. Do I want to go that way? That's where I came from. I can also go south now? Um, I'm gonna take a gamble and just go back to where we came from, I guess? I think that I, you know, I'm so turned around now. Let's just, let's roll with that. Okay, I don't know if this is where we came from or where we're going. I feel like there's gotta be a clue that I just missed. <laughs> missed. <laughs> um, all right, I guess we can just go forward here again. I should keep track of what I'm, where I'm going. I don't, I don't know if that's truly what I need to do or not. All right, um, I just went east, so don't go back that way. All right. Um, okay, we can go this way. Maybe I'm back on track now. I don't know. Um, get it back on track. I am on a roll today. Alright, it looks like we can just keep going forward, so let's just keep going forward, why not? I really don't know if this is even the answer, if I just missed a clue, and I'm... Oh, I don't know, 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 do 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 Okay, I just went south, so don't go that way. Okay, what about... There? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I, I really truly do not know. Yes, ma'am. All right, so I think, I don't know how long this track is supposed to be, but I think I'm just basically finding the um, next available entrance. That could, that could be what I'm doing. Okay. Mm. Okay. I can go there, so let's go here. I really hope I'm not just getting us completely lost, number one. Number two, I hope I'm not just driving in circles and I'm not even aware of it. I think I'll go for a couple more turns. If this goes on for like the next 30 minutes, we know I did something completely wrong. I'm gonna try to write some of these down to keep track of where we are. Um, all right, let's, let's see. Uh, there's one, all right, go north and northeast. Okay. I wonder if I just completely missed a clue. This is this is full panic now because I feel like we've been on this track for a really, really long time and maybe I just completely missed something. Um, <laughs> when I tell you this game gives me full body sweats, I, <laughs> I'm not exaggerating. I think it just came from there. I'm pretty sure. Or is that where I just, where did I just come from? I definitely came from one of those two, and I did not come from here. It says northeast. I'm just gonna go. We're just gonna go. Well, I think maybe it'll eventually direct us down the... I don't know. Okay. Right, 
I really, uh, I'm so stressed out about this already. Oh no, did I go the wrong way? No, maybe it's the right way? Maybe this is the end? I don't know. Oh gosh, there's a red dot at the back. Oh no, is it locked? That looks like a, like one of those locked door things. Do I want to backtrack? Maybe I don't want to backtrack. Maybe that's a bad idea. Can I get out? Oh, I can get out. Okay, let's go. Oh, I can't go over there. Oh, maybe go this way. Makes sense. Did I do that right? I don't... There is no way that that is the real... Like, just guess the path thing? I, there's gotta be a clue. If anyone knows if I just missed a clue on how to actually truly solve that puzzle, please let me know because that's gonna keep me up at night about I don't know the rhyme or reason for why we just did what we did, which is the main reason I never liked Mist, is because I never knew why I was doing something, and I don't like a game to just be like, here, figure it out. Um, so I have no idea what I just did, how I did it, there's no way I could explain that to somebody. Um, so if there is a puzzle, like, uh, not a puzzle, a clue that I missed, please let me know because I don't, I don't understand why I just did what I did. Or how that happened. Ooh, what is in here? Um, missed. Oh, I guess this takes me to a new place. Did I, did I just finish that? Okay. Um, I don't... Okay, where are we now? Oh, I'm back in the, the thingy in the library. Okay, um, oh, and I have a blue page that I can put in the blue book. Let's put the page in. All right, I think I put it in. Rescue me? I'm acting off. Um, you. Come on, you're the brother with good articulation. Tell me what you want. Always blue pages. Blue pages. Or just blue pages, I guess. I guess. Now listen to my brother. Nicotistical fool and a liar. Bring me the blue pages. Don't bring the red ones. Red ones? Don't bring the red ones. Oh, I've been wrongfully imprisoned. Must. I will have my retribution. Please bring me the blue pages. 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 All right, so he's been wrongfully imprisoned. I caught that. Um, retribution. That's another word I caught. Um, pages. Just blue pages. That's all this man wants. He's very easy to please. Oh, just, just homeboy just wants blue pages. So um, we'll, we'll do that for him. Um, but I feel like this is our good stopping point uh, for today's video. Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm intrigued. We're looking for more blue pages, but um, I think this is where I'm going to stop today. I don't know how I feel yet because I am still, like I said, in a full body sweat just from stress from this game. I feel very stressed out and like I don't know what I'm doing and that any move I make is probably a mistake. I am I feel very lucky that I got through that, you know, train twisty ship submarine puzzle. Uh, I don't think I actually knew what I was doing and I was just guessing. Uh, so like I said earlier, if you have any idea of what I could have possibly missed or if there was a different way I could have gone about something, please let me know in the comments because I'm genuinely trying to figure out why I'm doing what I'm doing because this is, again, the reason I don't like Mist and the why I said I would never play this again and because I did things in the game on my first playthrough that I didn't understand why I was doing it or how to do it and just fumbled through the game until I got to the end. So I actually genuinely want to figure out the story and see what I am missing. What is the hype about this game? Why do you like Mist? Um, 
I know there's a large missed fandom out there. There's so many, and I haven't played Riven or Exile because I just hate this game so much, but I'm glad that I'm going into this fresh-eyed, it's a different perspective. I do enjoy this. I think I'm going to look forward to the rest of uh, this playthrough. So I'm going to take it in little pieces, mostly to save my sanity. So I think I'm going to end it here, and I will be posting more uh, of this playthrough throughout the month, so keep an eye out for that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit subscribe. I will be releasing the rest of the playthrough in parts throughout the month, mostly to keep my sanity and not play this all in one sitting. Uh, so keep an eye out for those. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, my lovely people, and I will see you in the next video.